Attitude! Diecast Monster Truck Racing! Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a brand new season of Smash Down. Kick it off here tonight as the September season gets underway. 16 of the best trucks and drivers are going to be throwing it down all season long, trying to get the overall points championship as well as the championship flag to advance on in the new season. But we're also going to culminate this season at Worlds Collide, the big event at the end of the month. 16 trucks from Smash Down, 16 trucks from Thunder, all of them throwing it down at the Worlds Collide event. But tonight, these 16 trucks and drivers are going to be at each other's throats on a brand new course at the top of the track. Will Doomsday hang on to that championship flag they took home last week? We're going to find out. Here's how round one action is going to shake down. Iron Warrior set to take on Dragon. Earthshaker back to take on Bigfoot. Ram Nation taking on Son of a Digger. And then Excalibur taking on Monster by the other side of the bracket. We're going to see the return of Midnight Rider taking on Saigon Shaker. The Grinder Machine back to take on Little Tiger. Gravedigger taking on T-Max and closing out round one. Jason Cook in the Prowler taking on Doomsday. Ma Williams trying to hang on to that championship flag this season. And up at the line right now is Josh Brown and the all-new Dragon Machine. The truck's only been ran a few times on the MTA circuit. It's still brand new. Ready to take on Cam Blank and the Iron Warrior Ford all the way from Hagerstown, Maryland. He's now staged. He ran pretty good the last couple of seasons out. Trying to put Iron Warrior back on top of that MTA mountain. Who's it going to be in Advancing on in the round two competition. Dragon set to take on Iron Warrior. Both these trucks are staged. The points chase is on the line here tonight as we kick off the September season. We're waiting on green. Off the line they go now. They're fairly even. Iron Warrior with a slight lead. Here comes Dragon the inside lane. And I do believe Dragon may have came back on the Iron Warrior Ford there out of that inside lane. Josh Brown hammering down here inside a round one competition as we get ready to go back up and check out our MTA photo finish. Here it is, ladies and gentlemen, your winner in round one. Josh Brown and Dragon will edge out the Iron Warrior machine here tonight. He will advance on into round two. Now next up, inside round one competition is the return of downtown Mitch Brown all the way from Pacific, Missouri. The Bigfoot forward back in action here tonight on a technicality during registration. He's back in the driver's seat. Now ready to take on Ryan Kenny, new kid on the block. Emerged on the MTA scene just a couple of months ago. He's been a top threat out here, a thorn in everybody's side the all-new earth sugar ready to rock from the diggers diecast race team one of these drivers is going to move on and take on dragon inside round two boat truck stage up at the line we're waiting on the green light yeah, the straight stretch that goes are fairly even now. It's a good race up and over the car this week. Time there had an earth shaker in that far lane, and it may have cost him there at the finish line. Mitch Brown with an incredible slap really coming off that last set of cars in an unbelievable race here tonight inside a round one competition. Now we're going down to our MTA photo finish. This is how close it was, and your winner, downtown Mitch Brown in Bigfoot by inches with an incredible slap wheelie to boot. Taking out the Earthshaker machine. Up next at the line, all the way from Poplar Branch, North Carolina, Walker Stevens returning tonight. Son of a digger at the starting line. He is now ready to take on the Big Bad Dodge, all the way from Champaign, Illinois, the host of Crush This Podcast. Dan Chichagosh, Ramunition in the Dodge Camp, over on the outside lane, taking on Son of a Digger, one of the most dominant trucks of 2022. What's he got for the Big Bad Dodge here tonight? Inside a round one competition, both these drivers want this win bad, not just for bragging rights, but for the overall points chase. Stage now, here's the green light. Off the line they go down, the Dodge got the whole shot. Digger coming back on him now, and both of them keeping it low to the ground as they go across the finish line. It was close as Stevens got up on the van stack inside of the shutdown area, and Cheech and Ramunition taking it down to the wall inside that shutdown area. As we look at your photo finish, your winner, Dan Cheech or Gosh and Ramunition by inches over Son of a Digger as he got crossed up on that last set of cards. Now up next, ladies and gentlemen, here tonight inside round one, the bad boy himself, Johnny Retlaw returns in that beautiful square body Chevrolet, the legendary name Excalibur Rocket here tonight 
on the MTA circuit. He's now ready to take on a new kid on the block. New to the MTA scene, a rookie, Philip Torres, in that monster mutt stage there in the outside lane. So rookie versus veteran matchup here tonight inside round one competition. Both these drivers stage at the line. Again, they're all shooting for the overall points at the end of the month. Who's it going to be? Green light goes down and off the line. They go monster mutt with the early lead. And Calvin trying to make up the grab red line. Trouble, what a save! by the bad boy Johnny Redlaw taking it down to the shutdown area wall protection and what an incredible matchup it was as we go down to check out your MTA replay here off the line Philip Torres the rookie and monster but pulls out the whole shot here comes the bad boy and Excalibur trying to make up the ground he's about half a truck behind right here over the first jump caught a little bit of a bad bounce right there at the line he pulls out the win over monster but watch him ride it out on two wheels here going down to the wall keeps it on all fours right there and shiny side up an incredible save by Johnny Redlaw and Excalibur. Now next up at the line, Brad Anderson returns this time in an all-new truck. Saigon Shaker at the line, all the way from Del Mar, Maryland, out of the metal shop camp, ready to take on Justin Lamb in the Midnight Rider, a former Smashdown champion in his own right. He's trying to climb to the top of the MTA Mountain once again. He's got the Midnight Rider dialed in here tonight, look great and qualified. And Brad Anderson stays on the inside lane. Saigon Shaker ready to rock the house here tonight. Who's going on to round two? Midnight Rider taking on Saigon Shaker. Both truck stage. Here's the green right now off the line. There's Barely even out of the first jump, up and over the car, the big time air, what a willy by the Saigon Shaker over on the inside lane. I think he got the win over Justin Lamb. We have confirmed he is your winner tonight. Saigon Shaker advances on in the round two competition. Now next up, inside of round one, all new driver, Eddie Booker, the new kid on the block in the advanced auto parts grinder, ready now to take on Jason Wook, the crazy cat, the veteran in Little Tiger out of Big Lake, Minnesota, the Ford power plant in that far lane. Now ready to take on Advance Auto Parts Grinder here on the inside lane. A truck we haven't seen on the MTA circuit quite some time. Eddie Booker, new kid on the block. He's trying to make a headline here tonight and put Grinder at the top of the mountain. Who's it going to be? A great competition awaits us here tonight in round two. Little Tiger taking on Grinder. Bow trucks are staged. Green light goes down and off the line. Little Tiger with the lead. Grinder's right there with him on the car. And what a wheel stand by Little Tiger. And how about Eddie Booker in the grinder machine? He was right there with the veteran all the way down to the wall. Nonetheless, Little Tiger, your round one winner here tonight over the grinder machine. Next up inside round one competition, the Phenom returns. Rich Wagner in the grave digger trying to pick up his first smash down championship here tonight. He is now ready to take on Nathaniel Wiggins. He's been out here for well over a year now. The tracks is T-Max, former one-time Thursday Night Thunder champion. He's trying to put the big bad forward oval at the top of the heat here tonight. He's got to go through one of the best. The first ever Thursday Night Thunder champion, Rich Wagner and the Grave Digger in that far lane. Ford Chevrolet matchup, both trucks are staged. Here's the green light now and off the line. They go the Grave Digger with the early lead. Here comes T-Max on the inside lane. A wild ride for Wagner, but he gets the job done at the finish line. T-Max was right there with him as they closed in on that finish line. But Grave Digger number seven in spectacular fashion. Nose up in the air, went across the finish line first. Here's another look at your MTA photo finish. And it wasn't by much, maybe half a truck. But your winner, Rich Wagner and the Grave Digger, taking out T Max. And up at the line right now is the closeout round one action. Longtime MTA veteran back in the saddle, Jason Cook, the 2020 Wild Card Champion, now ready to rock in the Prowler machine with a big bad blown Chevrolet motor underneath them, 540 cubic inches, all the way from Brentwood, Tennessee. Taking on new sensation, Mad Mike, Ma Williams, and Doomsday holding on to that championship flag. Closing out round one competition is Jason Cook in the Prowler going to take. Take away the flag, or is Doomsday taking it to round two? Green light goes down the straight stretch of the chain, even down to the first jump, up and over the car, and it's all Ma Williams and Doomsday taking out Prowler. He put up a good fight over on the inside lane, but the Doomsday machine is running top notch, kicking off the September season here tonight. He's going to take the championship flag right on into round two competition. A tough break. Jason Cook wanted to do good, coming back after a long hiatus. Nonetheless, he'll have another shot next week. And ladies and gentlemen, Doomsday still hangs on to that championship flag as we go on into round two. We got more great racing still to come. Who's going to take it all the way to kick off the September season? We're going to find out next when we return from break.
if you can't get enough diecast monster truck racing action right here on MTA, be sure to check out our friends over at the Midwest Madness YouTube channel. Get ready to romp and stomp all over the track, tear up the trucks, and watch the carnage unfold. They host some of the best side-by-side -side diecast monster truck racing you will ever see. Also, check out all of our social medias. You can find them on Instagram, Facebook, as well as the Midwest Madness YouTube channel. Some great racing action you don't want to miss. Be sure to go over there and check them out. Like their videos and subscribe to the Midwest Madness YouTube channel. Welcome back to Smash Town, ladies and gentlemen, as we kick off round two competition. Dragon set to take on Bigfoot. Ramunition now set to take on Excalibur. And then other side of the bracket, Saigon Shaker taking on Little Tiger. And then closing out round two, the Gravedigger will take on Doomsday, a little rivalry that started last month. They're going to renew it here tonight. And up at the line right now, Josh Brown and the Dragon Machine look strong in round one competition, taking out Iron Warrior. Now ready to take on downtown Mitch Brown. No relation between the two, the Big Bad Four. Forward, all the way from Pacific, Missouri. Now stays on the outside lane. Bigfoot has four Smashdown championships to his credit. Mitch Brown, the most winningest driver on Smashdown. He's trying to make it number five here tonight. Taking out Dragon. Boat truck stage. Green light goes down and off the line. Now Bigfoot with the early lead. Here comes Dragon on the inside lane. And it's closed in the line. Mitch Brown dumps it on his lid. Inside the shutdown area, he got a nice slab wheelie as he went over that last set of cars. And he had nowhere to go but right into the van stack as he was trying to hold out Dragon all the way down to the wire. An incredible race as we go back. Check out your MTA replay off the line. It was all Mitch Brown and Bigfoot pulling out the whole shot on the Dragon Machine. But watch as they get closer down here to the first jump. Dragon starting to close the gap on the Bigfoot. They get some big time air here. And at the line right there, Mitch Brown and Bigfoot by literally inches taking out Dragon here tonight inside round two. There's the slap move that costed him as he got into the van stack, rolled the truck over. The crew's going to be down there thrashing, getting Bigfoot back for semi-final action. And next up, inside a round two competition, the bad boy himself, Johnny Retlaw and Excalibur, had an incredible save earlier tonight in round one competition. He is now set to take on the Dodge Camp, hailing out of Champaign, Illinois, Dan Chichagaj and Ramunition. So a Chevrolet and Dodge shootout here tonight inside a round two competition. A great matchup of two veteran trucks. Both these drivers want this win bad. Who will meet Bigfoot in semi-final action? Both trucks are staged. We're waiting on green. Off the line they go now. They're pretty even now. It's a good race going to the third jump. The big time here. And Calvin turns it over. Red Law unable to save it this time out. Here tonight inside of round two. Crossed up lanes. Almost got into Ramunition. And what an incredible matchup as both drivers hung it all the way down to the wire. Some incredible racing here tonight to kick off the September season. Here's another look at your replay. Off the line they go. They're dead even all the way down the straight tracks. Watch right here as they go up and over the first jump. They're still side by side all the way down to the finish line. And Ramunition will pick up the win. Red Law skidding the truck sideways. Unable to correct it this time and rolls it on over. So Bigfoot Ramunition in the first half of semifinals. We're going to figure out the second half right now. Brad Anderson returns out of Del Mar, Maryland. The Saigon Shaker ready to rock the house, ready to take on MTA veteran. Jason Wolf, the crazy cat. Little Tiger Ford all the way from Big Lake, Minnesota. He looks strong here tonight inside of round one. We're going to see what he's got from the old Saigon Shaker in that far lane. Both trucks are trying to reign supreme here tonight on the September season kickoff. Saigon Shaker, Little Tiger, we're waiting on the green light now. And off the line, they go Saigon Shaker with the early lead. Here comes Jason Wolk and Little Tiger on the inside. What a race it is, and Saigon turns it over. Much like Mitch Brown and Bigfoot did, went up the side of that van stack and dumps it on its lid. An incredible matchup still. Unsure who got the win as we go down to our MTA photo finish. Your winner, Jason Wolk and Little Tiger by about half a truck. Taking out Saigon Shaker. Who is he going to match up with in semifinal action? The Phenom returns all the way from Kill Devil Hills, North Carolina. Rich Wagner and the Gravedigger at the line. He is now set to rekindle the rivalry that started last month with Mad Mike. Ma Williams and that wicked fast doomsday took on two championship wins in his debut season. He's trying to reign on top here tonight. However, inside lane, Gravedigger, Rich Wagner has been on the MTA circuit since day one. He's got the veteran experience against New Kid on the Block who's the current champion. 
Who will meet Little Tiger inside semi-final action? Doomsday, Gravedigger, waiting on the green light now. Off the line they go down, Doomsday with the early lead. Here comes the Gravedigger on the inside lane. They make contact there as they come to a stop. Inside of the shutdown area, Doomsday got crossed up and smacked the digger in midair as they came across the finish line. Here's another look at your MTA replay right here off the line. Mad Mike, Ma Williams and Doomsday got the whole shot. The inside lane still falling behind off the start. Here comes the Gravedigger now making up the ground. Doomsday gets crossed up, making contact with Digger, and at the line, Rich Wagner and the Grave Digger will pull out the win, putting the current champion on the trailer. Luckily, nobody rolled the truck over here tonight in round two competition. Nonetheless, Grave Digger will move on and take on Little Tiger in semifinal action. So, we will crown an all-new Smash Down champion here tonight to kick off the September season. So, ladies and gentlemen, Remunition versus Bigfoot, Grave Digger versus Little Tiger, semifinal action coming up next after the break. This isn't your typical motorsports podcast. You're listening to Crush This, a monster truck podcast presented by High Octane Coffee and J Concepts. A show where we take you inside the minds of your favorite drivers, past and present, of the monster truck industry. And now, your hosts, Brad Shaw and Dan Chichagash. Buckle in. The show starts now. And welcome back to Smash Down, ladies and gentlemen, as we kick off the September season. I want to take a moment and remind you guys, coming up on September 30th, Worlds Collide, the biggest event at the end of September. 32 trucks, but it's not just any 32 trucks. 16 trucks from Smash Down are going to take on the 16 trucks from Thursday Night Thunder and a shootout to see which brand reigns supreme. Smash Down versus Thunder at Worlds Collide, September 30th, right here on the MCA YouTube channel. And back now on Smashdown, ladies and gentlemen, as we kick off semi-final action, Bigfoot will take on Ramunition. Other side of the bracket, Little Tiger will take on the Grave Digger. The only new kid on the block may be Dan Chichagaj in Ramunition as he got his MTA start at the top of the year. He's been nothing but impressive since his debut. Right now, he's got to go against one of the better drivers on the MTA circuit, downtown Mitch Brown. His resume speaks for itself. The forward out of Pacific, Missouri, representing the Bigfoot camp. There you see Dan Chichagaj, the Dodge Power Ramunition. He's been taking MTA by storm, trying to put the Dodge out of Champaign, Illinois, on top of the mountain here tonight. This is going to be a dandy matchup here tonight, ladies and gentlemen. The Dodge Camp taking on the Ford Camp. Both trucks are staged. Green light goes down off the line. Ramey Nixon with the other lead. Bigfoot trying to make up the ground. Here he's out of shape. What a matchup it is. An incredible leap for Mitch Brown and Bigfoot. Got a little out of shape over that last of the cars. He got it corrected the whole time. Cheech in that far lane and Ramey Nixon kept his foot down to the floor. An incredible matchup as we figure out who won this race. MTA photo finish determines Dan Cheech and Gosh and Ramey Nixon by a nose will take out the Bigfoot. He finds himself in the final round kicking off the September season. Who is he going to meet there? Because now two MTA veterans are going to be throwing it down. The Phenom Rich Wagner and the Crazy Cat, Jason Wolf and Little Tiger. Now both these drivers have been around the block on the MTA circuit. Again, Rich Wagner took on the very first Thursday Night Thunder Championship now resides in the Grave Digger Machine. The Crazy Cat, Jason Wolf. He has two Smash Down Championships to his credit. The Ford out of Big Lake, Minnesota. Which driver is going to meet up with Ramunition in the finals? Stage now. Green light goes down on the line. They're pretty much even now. Slightly going to Grave Digger. Here comes Little Tiger on the inside lane. What a matchup as Grave Digger gets into him inside the shutdown area. These races tonight, folks, have been absolutely on top of their game here tonight by all these drivers. So close matchups. Here's how close it was tonight. Little Tiger and Gravedigger in semifinals. Your winner, Jason Wook and Little Tiger by inches, taking out the Gravedigger. So he's going to meet up with Ramy Nishin in our final round showdown, kicking off the September season of Smash Down. But we're going to take one more break, ladies and gentlemen. The finals are coming up next. The Dodge out of Champaign, Illinois. The Ford out of Big Lake, Minnesota. Ramy Nishin takes on Little Tiger for the championship flag after the break.
And ladies and gentlemen, if you can't get enough die-cast monster truck racing, we told you about our friends over at Midwest Madness. We want to take you over to another YouTube channel. That is Monster Truck Championship. They throw down each and every week for the Monster Truck Wars on Monday nights at 7.30 p.m. Eastern Time. So if you can't get enough die-cast racing, be sure to go check out Monster Truck Championship over on YouTube, Facebook, and Instagram. You won't regret it. They got some of the top trucks in the league, and they're ready to throw down for you each and every week on Monday nights. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the September season kickoff of Smash Down. We are now set for the final round showdown. Little Tiger versus Ramunition. A couple of great trucks up in the line right now. Jason Wolf, the crazy cat, and the big leg Minnesota base Ford. Now set to take on Dan Chichagaj and the Ramunition Dodge all the way from Champaign, Illinois. Both these drivers want to get on top of the mountain early on in the Smash Down season here tonight. A Ford Dodge shootout. A veteran driver taking on a fairly new driver. It's anybody's ball game here tonight. Little Tiger on the inside lane. Ramunition on the outside lane. Ford versus Dodge. Who's it going to be? Ladies and gentlemen, Little Tiger. Ramunition. It's showtime here tonight on Smash Down. Little Tiger with the other lead. Here comes Ramunition on the inside lane. The big time there. Can you believe that? Little Tiger sticks it on the nose at the wall inside the shutdown area. What a race it was. Ford Dodge shootout here tonight in our final round. And Jason Wolf has just incredibly wowed the fans here tonight. Sticking it on the nose, leans it against the wall, trying to shut it down. They did make a little bit of contact down in the shutdown area. Here's our NTA replay. Little Tiger pulled the whole shot as that far lane had been doing all night. Ramunition catching up with him on the inside lane. Big time air by both drivers. And it's Little Tiger at the line pulling out the win as he crossed up on the van stack, got into Ramunition and set it up against the wall in incredible fashion. What a way to announce your presence here tonight on Smash Down. But ladies and gentlemen, at this time, please help me congratulating the crazy cat, Jason Wolf, on your third Smash Down Championship. And now, ladies and gentlemen, as we take a look at the overall point standings as we kicked off the September season of Smashdown in tonight's big win, Jason Wolf, the crazy cat, leads the overall points with 100 and Little Tiger in rounding out your top five. A lot of close racing action here tonight. Dan Chichagosh and Ramy Nisha with 90 points. The Phenom, Rich Wagner and Gravedigger with 80 points. And right behind him, downtown Mitch Brown in the Bigfoot camp with 80 points to their own right. And again, rounding out your top five. Mad Mike, Ma Williams and Doomsday. New kid on the block, the new sensation of Smashdown with 60 points. And ladies and gentlemen, we had a lot of great close racing action all night long. It's only going to get better as the season progresses. And again, these 16 trucks are going to be facing off against the 16 trucks from Thursday Night Thunder at the end of the month at Worlds Collide. So be sure to stay tuned for that. Thank you all for coming out and watching Smash Down as we kick off this September season here tonight. We hope to see you back next week and this Thursday on Thunder.